Hello everyone, this is John with Siptopia.org. Today we are going to learn about installing Python in Kali Linux. Now if you type Python in your terminal, you'll notice that Kali comes with Python installed by default and this version is 2.7.3 and it's from 2014. So it's not that outdated. Let's, let's put the terminal down and go to python.org and see what versions are available at the moment. So look 3.x and 2.x these are two huge uh, releases and let's click on this link that says uh, more about the differences. So Python 2 is legacy, Python 3 is present and future of the language. However, Python 3 was released in 2008. Now keep in mind our current installation is from 2014. So let's, let's take a look at other things. Let's, let's figure out what else is different between the two. So obviously there is a library support issue with 3.x. I mean, if you look down, it's that one of the modules not supported is twisted. That's that's huge for networking. Uh, we, we, we cannot go with 3.x as twisted is going to be one of the things we will rely on. So there is this link that shows which, let's go to this link that shows which modules are not yet supported by 3.x. But if you look at these uh, red entries, uh, granted it's not too many, uh, there are some crucial things like Twisted, as I mentioned, and a bunch of others that are not yet supported. So I'm gonna have to go with 2.x, but Let's download 3.x and for the sake of this video, let's let's find out how to install this. So let's go to your terminal. I'm already in desktop. As you can see, I downloaded the package. Now let's take a look at uh, the, the tar command. If you don't, if you're not familiar with it, uh, if you read the man pages for tar, it's gonna give you all the information you need. Now tar minus xf space name of the file is what we need to do here so type tar space minus xf space python enter now on the left as you can see it's already extracted a folder now let's let's change directly to that folder now we need to type dot slash configure and enter now this is going to take some time so I'm gonna fast forward a little so while we are going to the future the installation completes now as you can see a make file is created so now we are going to type make file, I'm sorry, make, enter. This is going to take some time too. So let's again fast forward into the future. Once that process is complete, there is one more thing left and that's make space alt install enter. Again, <laughs> let's fast forward to the future just a tiny bit. This process is gonna take a few minutes. It's not too long, but I didn't wanna waste people's time. So let's fast forward to the future and boom. Now the installation is complete. Now, again, if you, if you type Python, our default is still 2.7.3. But we have installed Python 3.x and you can see that by typing Python 3.4 and enter. As you can see, it's already entered. So 
in the future we can actually move uh, to phytontree.x if you want to use it uh, as the default version otherwise uh, we are going to stay with 2.x for the time being if you have any questions or comments about this video or requests for other tutorials please let us know thank you bye bye